after the old jamboree of Apabio's birthday, who was celebrating just 61st birthday and rented out a whole stadium for the celebration, you would think that he was celebrating 60 or 75 or 65 or 60, you know, and running around the stadium like someone who, <laughs> who has the intention to run for Olympics. Now there are, you know, according to news sources that uh, uh, Pabio, Senate president, collapses after birthday bashed and was rushed to the hospital. Why won't it collapse? Why won't it collapse? Pardon me. He was running around the stadium like someone who wants to who wants to contest for president, like someone who is campaigning. Ha! You rented out a whole stadium just for birthday celebration. You did not do it on your sister's birthday. But now that you have enough money to steal, you have enough money, you know, at your disposal, even took out a whole, a whooping 800 million naira from, from the Senate account, asked ministries, agencies to contribute money towards your birthday. Because any president is doing birthday, everybody had to contribute. <laughs> May God help us soon. Hello and welcome back to Newsroom Nigeria, my people. If this is your first time here, please subscribe, like this video, leave your opinions in the comment section below. Don't forget also to turn on the post notification bell so that you can be the first person to get notified whenever we upload a new video. Breaking news. Senate President Apabio collapses after birthday bash, rush to the hospital. Senate President Gosu Apabio slumped and was rushed to the hospital on Thursday after his birthday celebration at the, at the Transcorp Hilton Hotel in Abuja. According to Newsroom Nigeria, Apabio collapsed while escorting President Bola Tinobu out of the ceremony ground. Tinobu and other dignitaries had gathered in the hotel's Congress Hall for a colloquium to commemorate the Senate President's 61st birthday in Abuja. Newsroom Nigeria noted that Apabio was momentarily stabilized before being brought to the hospital. Senate President Apabio collapsed after his 61st birthday colloquium in Abuja while seeing the president off. He was briefly stabilized before being rushed to the NNPC hospital in Abuja where he was wheeled into a special room on a stretcher. He has remained at the hospital, sources told Newsroom Nigeria. All efforts to reach Eseme Eyibo, the Senate President's media aide via phone call, have been unsuccessful as his number kept saying busy as of the time of his report. Meanwhile, President Tinobu said at the ceremony that the executive and legislative branches of government would work together to address Nigeria's difficulties. He added that the difficulties confronting the country will be collaboratively examined by the executive and legislature to provide implementable solutions for the benefit of Nigerians. Having Senate President Apabio and the Speaker of a House of Representatives write Honorable Abbas on my side is enough for me to succeed and we will succeed. A statement signed by Chief Ajuri in Gelale, Special Advisor to the President on Media and Publicity, quoted Tinobu as saying at the event, I believe in the person of Senator Godzu Apabu. He is truly in God's will for, for his life. I was governor in Lagos State from 1999 to 2007, and he was a commissioner. You all, what are your thoughts? Please let's have them in the comment section below. What do you all think about all of this? Anyway, from Newsroom Nigeria, we wish Senate President Gozo Apabio, you know, quick recovery. What are your thoughts? Please let, let us know in the comment section below. 
Before we go, let's take a look at some of the reactions we got online. Fidelis Onyechi says, God just show him how vanity is all, is all this human bravado on earth. If he has not been revived, that could have been the end of it. Yeah, I feel that God wanted to show him how great he is and how vanity upon vanity is everything that we do on earth. Because how can you squander that much amount of money all because you are celebrating your 61st birthday? I do not even have any problem with them celebrating it, boy. You should have used your own money to celebrate. You shouldn't have asked ministries, agencies, to uh, senators to contribute money for you. Or you shouldn't have also gone into the post of the Senate to, to take out money just for your birthday celebration. In fact, you know, I feel God wants to show him that everything, all these things that you are doing on it, stealing and everything will come to an end one day. You come and report to me. Even if you are not held accountable on earth, you are going to be held accountable in heaven one day. One day, one day, you will be before me and you are going to be judged. Another person by the name of Augustine says, Celebrating too much money when Nigerians are, 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 are in hardship, God must disgrace someone. It is true and it's quite very insensitive of these people our politicians are not very sensitive that is another thing nothing consigned them as long as they have enough money to squander and spend around they do not care they are not sensitive to the pains you know and hardship that people are going through the president keeps asking people to bear with him you know be patient give him time bear with us manage people are suffering people are, are in hardship but on the other hand we are seeing you people, you know, squandering money, spending lavishly, living the, la, diva, uh, la vida loca. Eh? Why are you asking people to, 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 to manage? It's just not fair. It's not so. It's not fair at all. Lastly, someone says, you must be very stupid and useless Nigerian youth. I don't blame you because you don't have respect for, for people. If you even have one, nonsense. So what does this one say? Hey, oh my gosh. There are some people that are very blind supporters of these politicians. They will support, 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 support. Probably is a family member or something. Only God knows. You all, thank you very much for always watching and listening. I will see you all in my next video. Bye for now.